Hundreds of families in Tana Delta are celebrating this festive season in the cold after their homes were submerged by the raging floods from Tana River. Locals are now calling for an urgent government intervention with waterborne diseases already being reported in several villages as Stephen Leto now reports. The prolonged heavy rains in the country has caused destruction, left homeless hundreds of residents of Tana River living downstream. Villages in the delta are submerged, with locals now fleeing their homes to safer higher grounds. Lakini sisi wa wae hae, ibidi tubaki hapa, manake tuwajua hatupati usaidizi, na rasinmali yetu hatutoshi sisi kuhama nao. Wamama katha, wakuna shide watutuwa na homa, kuna outbreak ya malaria, Kwa sababu sahi umbu wamekua wengi wamezana na hivyo hivyo kuna typhoid, kuna kesi ya typhoid hapa na maji wanakunywa, maji ndio hii rangi enyewe inaonyesha maji ni black. Hata ngombe hatuna mahali ya kulisha. Kwa vile sahi hatuna darura hata kidogo. Sahi tunatarajia hata kidogo sahi ki, ki emergency tunataka chakula kidogo hii jaraka. Attempts to have their livestock move to safer grounds, even putting them at risk of being swept away. Sisi hapa kina mama tukotabu, maji imekuja hata chakula hakuna, mahali kulinda wangombe yetu hakuna, na sisi tunatabu saa hii, kwa sirikali ya Kenya tafadhali ya tumuoke sisi. In Mwanja village, for instance, there are 350 households with close to 2,000 occupants has been worse hit with only 150 managing to voluntarily go to safe grounds but the rest are still living there. Their homes fully submerged and crops in their farms destroyed. Hundreds of families are now forced to live in the temporary camps with no food to eat. A five-day weather forecast by the Meteorological Department showing heavy rains will continue pounding Tana River, Kilifi and Kuala counties. Stephen Leto, Citizen TV.